Hello and welcome to the first official Otaku Tavern update video. I'm Fat Man. And I'm Zyra, your lovable zombie waitress. Oh man. It's been forever since we've done this together. I've honestly missed hanging out with you, boss. Yeah, uh, I've been really busy recently. I think we all have. I mean, yeah, there's been this huge pandemic going on, but it's like life still finds a way to keep going. Yeah, you'd think I'd have more time staying inside. Well, you you recently got that job, didn't you? Yeah. Well, that's that's one thing that's kept you busy. And I've finally been able to update my computer. Yay! Completely new computer, best one I've ever had, and it produces videos like... No Tomorrow? It's so good. And I got a new mic! Nice. It's a Razer Kraken Kitty Edition. Hmm. Oh, one of the uh, cat ear things. Yeah. Those are pretty cool. They were expensive. Yeah, I bet. $165. That's an expensive headset. But, I mean, the quality is great, right? Yes, it is. Anyways, let's, uh, let's tell them all the fun, amazing stuff we've got planned. We've got some ideas for a couple new shows that we're going to be working on in the coming months. Ah, so for those of you who are big anime fans, you know that recently they've decided to uh, try and make live action versions. So we're going to compare the two. Oh, yeah. I saw that uh, Full Metal Alchemist movie. Oh, don't, yep. don't, don't, don't get me started with that one. I mean, I'll rewatch it, but... Ugh. <laughs> We have our opinions. Indeed. And whether our opinions are the same as yours, that is completely fine. We're just here to bring you entertainment, good laughs, and just a great general time together. As well as future animes that you may enjoy. I just like talking. Well, of course you do. Then again, <laughs> so do I. <laughs> Can't wait to talk about that Bleach movie. Oh god, yeah. I mean, I could go into it now, but I think I'm going to wait. Yeah. We've also got an idea for this Blast from the Past show, where we talk about all the nostalgic shows we watched as children. As well as anime that are reaching their past decade uh, birthdays. Yeah. Examples of those would be uh, Yu Yu Hakusho. Digimon. Pokemon. Oh, Digimon. Digimon, Digital Monsters, Digimon, Digimon are the <laughs> champions. And here it goes. I am so sorry, everyone. Champions to <laughs> save the digital world. <laughs> <laughs> um, as for Pokemon, I know some of you are thinking of like, oh god, are they going to watch all of it? Um, we've decided that we're going to base it off of gaming consoles. So, Game Boy, Game Boy Advance, and SP. Yeah. Because right now, those are more of the retro, because right now, the DS is still more or less a high-end console, in a way. I know a lot of you are going to be like, what the heck is she talking about? Games that came out uh, uh, with the generations yeah. before DS. Yes. So, we will be traveling through the Orange Islands again with Ash, Misty, and Tracy. Ah, uh, fuck Tracy. Oh, come on. His scyther's pretty cool. <laughs> uh, he replaced Brock, and he was kind of boring. But he was still a cool guy. But he was no Brock. Nobody can replace Brock. That's why Brock came back. <sighs> Anyways, we've got a few more things to touch up on in this video. Uh, I've improved the audio quality of our recordings. Yep. We've started recording with uh, Zencaster, which has been fantastic for editing. Instead of recording everyone in the same track, I've been able to balance and noise cancel each person individually. So this year is the year of audio quality for the Otaku yep. Tab. As well as uh, for those of you who are curious, um, the other reason we have not been uploading as frequently with the amazing art we normally do is um, our artist's computer uh, broke. Yeah. Uh, we, we did recruit two others. 
So we're slowly still trying to work things out with them. Yes. So we will try and get those uh, digital artwork thumbnails back, as well as some fun little snippets that we throw together. We'd also like to get some uh, chibis drawn of our characters to use as assets in future videos. Yep. Uh, Another thing we plan on doing is, this is something I've actually been quite excited for, is the uh, emotional uh, images of us. Oh, yeah. Uh, just pictures of a characters in different with different facial expressions and whatnot, right? Uh, essentially, yeah. So, like, if you've ever uh, seen Voicey here, he started doing stuff like that recently. Yeah, or Saber Spark, or Ostruck Vox. Yep. They're essentially ways for our avatars, who aren't normally seen as often in the thumb. Well, I mean. When our amazing artist Asmodeus does the art, we're always in the thumbnails. But yeah. it gives us a way to interact with you while we're talking about the anime that we are reviewing. Yeah, a little bit more of a uh, hands-on experience. Uh, with that out of the way, uh, Kruger and I are going to be recording some more videos in the near future, so look out for some more happy hour videos. Which Gundam are you guys on now, by the way? The one that we are currently watching is Gundam 00. Okay, fair enough. Now, don't forget, you said you'd let me know when you were on Gundam Builders, because I want in on that biz. Absolutely. Because, oh my goodness, is it good. And I apologize if I slip into an accent. Wait, no, I'm not. (laughs) I've not seen any of the uh, Gundam build shows. Yeah, I I think you'll enjoy them. They're they're pretty good. I like model kits. It it seems like it has something to do with model kits, and I appreciate that. Yeah, so the premise is that they've created a system where a Gunpla builder can essentially create their dream Gundam. And for those who don't know what Gunpla is, it just says... It is essentially the creation of a mobile suit Gundam model. Right. Uh, So the premise of this is they make their Gundams, and then they are able to scan it into this digital world where they make guilds, uh, do quests... like an MMO? Exactly! It, it's an MMO, but with Gundams. I thought they fought with the little miniature figures. No! That's what they want you to think, but the figure is just there to represent what their Gundam looks like in-game. Well, that's pretty cool. So, the original version was, yes, the figures were controlled with a remote, but it was then upgraded to where... It's now digital because a lot of the time the models would break or get damaged. Right. And as somebody who has put a lot of time into making their Gundam, it's always heartbreaking to see something you've worked so hard on get destroyed. I uh, remember when we, when Kruger and I put together that uh, that Barbatos figurine. It took like three, four hours. I- I'm talking. Imagine a professional gunpla maker taking days or weeks to put together the right parts and balancing the system gluing actually painting yeah yeah wow uh okay so i definitely will let you know when we get to that thank you so much um also i I figured we'd try something a little new i had brought this uh idea to my amazing boss uh we have a subscriber goal uh, we would like to try and hit 100 subscribers, which, by the way, we have officially passed our first threshold. We have over 50 subscribers. I can't believe that. Oh, it's true. In fact, I'm going to check and see if we've gotten any new ones, which, nope, we're still sitting pretty at 60, which I'm okay with, you know? Yeah, that's not a bad number. It's honestly not. And I mean, for those of you who have been here with us from the start, we appreciate you for sticking around, watching us through these hiccups. And for those of you who are new to the tavern, thank you for coming by, hanging out, and putting the time into subscribing for us. It means the world to us. Because to be honest, for the longest time, We weren't sure if we were going to even make it this far. We've been doing this for a little bit over a year now. 
with the Otaku Tavern channel. Yep. And to think that we have 60 people watching our videos and supporting us, it's baffling. I know. It's like we're just a group of otakus. We're, 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 we're nerds. And Doing we talk about our nerdiness. And there is nothing wrong with that. Nah. So, uh, if you've been here with us since the beginning, thank you so much. Uh, anyone else that's hopped on since then, recently... Welcome uh, to the family. Thank you so much for being here with us. But yeah, I mean, to see where we had started way back before the tavern was a thing, to where we are now is just insane. Yeah, we've got art, we've got better audio and editing software we're more organized oh yeah (laughs) Uh, anything else you'd like to touch on um well i mean just bits and pieces Uh, again um if you have not subscribed please like like our videos subscribe if there's an anime you want us to watch and review let us know in the comments be like hey guys I've heard this anime is really good, but I don't know if I want to watch it. Can you tell me about it? That sort of thing. Uh, One anime I know for sure Fat Man's looking forward to is called Ascendance of a Bookworm. It's, oh, yes! The second season finally finished, and I can't wait to make an episode on it. uh, Shush. Quiet. We're not spoiling. So, if that sounds interesting to you, Please, again, subscribe, and we will let you all know as soon as that episode is done. And knowing Fat Man, he is going to want to not just cover season one, but season two. So look forward to Ascendance of a Bookworm Part 1 and Part 2. Yay! (laughs) Again, this has been Zyra, your amazing patchwork waitress. And Fat Man, your... Dapper, Oni, <laughs> tavern owner. You're also the amazing bartender. Oh, yeah, I do that. <laughs> but, I mean, again, just thank you. Um, stay safe. Make sure you wash your hands. And social distancing, everybody. We have actually set up our tavern for social distancing. <laughs> but we can just magically expand its size so it doesn't matter too much. True, true, true. But also, I almost forgot our new banner oh, was yeah. done by an amazing artist. Uh, we will be advertising his information in the description once I get it. Also, join our Discord. Indeed. Join our Discord. Become a part of the tavern. We've actually added some new roles to better include you guys. So, yeah. Come in. Talk with us. We're having a great time doing that. And... We'll be doing this for a while. Even though that's been a while since we've posted much. (laughs) Oh, well, I put up a video about three days ago. And it's already gotten five views. Yay. All right. Uh, I guess we'll talk to you next time. Yep. We will see you all next time on the next episode next week of Night Parade, where we're actually going to cover Beastars. All right. Take care. See you all later.